One of the most fragrant plants for July are lilies, which we can confirm because the studio smells wonderful this morning. <laughs> Absolutely. And Dave is back and he's going to share with you why this is the year to give them another shot. You know, if, if it didn't work before, you've been holding off. Now is the time. Good morning, Dave. Yeah, I think that uh, I want to revisit growing ornamental lilies. So there was a, a beetle, the lily beetle, which is actually came from Europe, found in Cambridge, 1992, first came to New England and spread through New England. Defoliated people who had these beautiful lilies in their yards and people said, eh, I'm giving up. We had a parasitic wasp that's been released over the past several years now. And it's colonized enough that even if you get the lily beetle a little bit, it tends to keep it under control. So this is stargazer lily, one of the most fragrant and commonly grown lilies. It's absolutely fantastic, and they're not kidding. And I've started growing lilies again in my yard, and they look good. And yes, I sometimes see a beetle or two, but I actually leave it because then the larvae happen, the wasp comes in, and it colonizes on the little larvae of the beetle. And yeah, some of my leaves get eaten by them, but look at, they look really good. And this seems to be under control again. So I want you to try to grow these. If you love them, um, it's a great time. So I have not been treating my lilies this year with any sort of pesticides at all. And as I said, some of the leaves, yeah, they've gotten eaten a little bit, but look, the white ones, uh, my stargazers, uh, these are, I love the white against the house. We have a little bit of brick at the base of the house and the white really pops up nicely. These are almost four and a half feet tall and they just look really healthy. Uh, the other thing you can do, so you can buy them now in a container uh, like this, or now is the time, I hate to talk about fall, but start looking through catalogs and you can find the lilies and you want to order them. And the reason to do it now is prices are better and they're also not going to run out. So it's a great time to kind of go through the catalogs, think about what you want for bulbs in the fall, and lilies should be on the list. Ladies? 